Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of Android application development tutorial. In today's episode, we are going to learn an important use of Android notification. You can place a progress bar on an Android notification. So by placing a progress bar on Android notification, you can show your application update status on the notification. Also you can show some download status, file download status on the notification. So in this episode, I am going to show you how to place a progress bar on an Android notification. So start a project in Eclipse or Android Studio. So here I already start a project in Android Studio. Here I am going to display the notification with a button click. So here on the activity main.xml file, I already add a button. And here I define an on click method for this button called display notification and I define that method in the main activity.java file okay so here I am going to create the notification first so for creating notification first you have to create an object of notification combat.builder notification combat yeah, this one dot builder I name the object as builder equal to new builder okay pass this as context object okay so for displaying for creating the notification we need some notification ID for that here I create a variable final int notify ID I initialize this variable with the value 1 and for issuing the notification we need an object of notification manager so final notification manager I name the object as num equal to get system service context dot the service name is notification service okay here you need to typecast this into notification manager okay so now I am going to add a progress bar into the notification so for displaying a progress we need some long task so for creating a long task here I am going to use a thread so here I am going to start a thread new thread runnable new thread new yeah this one new runnable ok also here I start the thread using start method so here I am going to add a progress bar add a progress bar into the notification so we need a for loop here for executing the for loop here we need another variable I name the variable as tr uh, I name the variable ICR okay and start a for loop here for initialize the variable ICR with the value 0 and put the condition I less than or equal to 100 I put the value 100 because here I set the maximum size of the operation maximum size of the percentage percentage of the progress is 100 that's why I put the put the value 100 and I I increment the value ICR by 5 equal to 5 I increment the variable ICR by 5 this is because I need to update the progress by 5 percentage of 100 okay this is not I this is ICR okay so now here I am going to add 
a progress bar into the notification so builder dot for adding the progress bar into notification you have to use a method called set progress it has three arguments the first argument is the maximum progress percentage so here I take the maximum progress percentage as 100 so I put the value 100 now you have to specify the current progress so you can get the current progress from variable ICR so ICR and final one is a boolean so if the progress is determinate then you have to pass true and if the sorry if the progress is determinate then you have to pass false if it is indeterminate then you you have to pass true so here we know what is the maximum size of the progress it is 100 that means it is a determinate progress so we have to pass false okay so before going to add the progress into notification we have to set um, so we have to set some icon and title for the notification so builder dot set small icon or dot drawable dot I use the default icon IC launcher okay now we have to specify some content title so builder dot set content title content title put some content title I name the content title as download status download status ok and now we have to set some content text so builder dot set content text I name the text as download in progress ok that's enough so here we set the progress now here I am going to display the notification for the first time so use the notification manager object dot use this method notify first you have to specify the notification id here we set the notification id on the variable notify id so notify id dot builder dot call the method build okay so for the first time it will display the notification with a progress bar and each time this loop execute instead of recreating the progress in instead of recreating the notification the Android system will automatically update the notification with the increment value of variable ICR okay so after executing this loop that means the entire progress will finish we have to notify the user that the download is completed so after finishing this loop also we have to dismiss the progress bar, progress bar from the notification so first we have to dismiss the progress bar from the notification so for dismissing the progress bar we have to call the method set progress again so for dismissing the progress bar you have to specify 0 as maximum progress size and 0 as current progress size also specify whether it is determinate or indeterminate okay now I am going to change the content text of this notification so builder dot set content text download complete okay so after this change we have to update the progress bar again sorry notification again so nm dot notify first specify the notification id so notify id builder dot build okay 
now we complete all the coding now we can check the project so here I am going to run the application so click the run button ok one more thing here we have to sleep the thread for some time we forget that so here I am going to sleep the thread so thread dot sleep the thread for 2 seconds so 2 into 1000 this will sleep the thread for 2 seconds so you have to surround this with try catch block ok that's enough now we can run the application again so I run the application again ok now I run the application again and here I am going to display the notification so click this button now the notification is available here you can see that now a progress bar is available with the notification and you can see the progress is changing from 0 to 100 it is changed by 5 percentage because we increment that variable by 5 percentage that's why it's incrementing 5 percentage and each sleep is 2 seconds now also you can check here the content text is download in progress so now here when we finish the progress the android system will update the notification so now it is almost finished yeah now it's finished is complete the progress now you can see that now the android system will automatically update the progress bar now the progress bar is dismissed from the notification and now the content of the notification is changed into download complete this is how we use a progress bar with an android notification please subscribe to this channel now for getting more video updates on your youtube homepage as well as on your email i hope you enjoy this video thank you for watching see you in the next episode